Hey guys, I'm ready to get away, and today we're here back on this man 21 Giants for six. Week number 16, we are here to our final two games of the regular season. We're taking on the Ravens, who are 8-6 and six and are striving for a playoff position. Did I say 2-6? and six? I, I, I meant 8-6. and six. If I said 2-6, and six, I can't remember. Um, they're striving for a playoff spot. However, they are fourth out of the seven teams that do make it. So if they are to lose this game, they will need to win next week's game. Um, I don't think there are any changes to teams in the playoffs. Um, I think they've all stayed the same. Rankings have changed. I know the Seahawks were fourth. They went to sixth. I'm pretty sure the Bears were fourth. Wait, no. I don't remember. They might have been fifth. I can't remember. Um, let's just get this game started. We're taking on the Ravens. Um, we're not home for this one. But it's not far. Weekly awards. Uh, Trubisky, he got... Uh, NFC offense and then Julian Love for NFC defense with two interceptions and four tackles uh, Giants game just watch that and the Giants won. Yes first time since 2016. I've been in the Eagles a uh, great game I loved that game. It went according to plan uh, Daniel Jones had a great game. He's a goat. Um, all right. Yeah, let's wear the color rush this week and the Ravens Can wear. I actually like the 1990s jerseys, so why not have them wear those? All right, we are ready to take on Lamar Jackson, Mark Andrews, and whoever else is on the Ravens. Oh, uh, Marquise Brown. Who else? I know there's more players. Than the Ravens. I just don't know who to pick. Um, the Ravens. They got Mark Ingram, who's eh. As 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 I'm I'm looking down, I look up Mark Andrews. Evan Ingram's not even starting. Uh, Marlon Humphrey. All right, here we go. Today, from m and Harbaugh, yay. All right, Saquon Barkley is having a great season. Here we go. Week 16, last two weeks of the season. As we start, we return to start the game, and we are underway. Oh, yeah, Super Bowl 35. This is a rematch of Super Bowl 35. Good return up to the 31 for Corey Ballantyne. We took on the Browns last week, and we beat them. They're striving for the playoff spot. Um, I think Dallas is practically in at this point. There's like 19 teams, I think, total that are really competing for the playoffs. And we're going to find Golden Tate on the first play of the game for a pretty good gain of 22 yards. 22 yards on the catch and run, a first down. Good way to start the game. Of course, Lamar Jackson, he's going to be trouble in this one, so we're going to have to play the best we can. And did Barkley get it across? He's going to be about a yard shy. Season stats, 122 rushes, 1,553 yards, and 21 touchdowns. 18 carries, 108 yards. So good season from Barkley ever since his comeback. I don't think it's possible to hit 2,000 rushing yards, but Barkley gets another good run. This time for a first down. That one good for 26 and a first down. A gain of 20. Another fine carry from the Daniel NFL Jones made history leader. last game. Typically dominating the MVP Leads the uh, record for most I passing agree. touchdowns. Oh my gosh! Intercepted. Picked off by the Pro Bowler Marcus Peters. And he will bring this all Well, that did not go according to plan. Um looked like we were gonna Jones score a through. Terrible pass to uh, Sterling Shepard, and they took it all the way back to the 50. Yeah, that did not go well. 220 rushes, 968 yards, seven touchdowns. Some people haven't even hit a thousand rushes. Oh wait, what? The 20th tackle this season for Xavier McKinney. In their team meeting this week. And QB option, we're going to be seeing a lot of that as he went nowhere. Oh, hitting the whip. You know what, if we're killing him at the end of the game, we might put in Trace McSorley because he used to be on the Ravens. He got a drop like early, so. McSorley's revenge. <laughs> Fourth and 
and five. Yeah, coach tells all the time to have a powerful arm isn't the number one thing for a quarterback. When you're the Ravens. And she's going to punt this one. The big gun. In this case, uh oh. Just a All right, just go out of bounds. That could have been much worse if it just rolled well back There's to like the one. Out of bounds at the five yard line. All right. Let's try not to um, do what we did last drive. Daniel Jones, four interceptions on the year. He didn't throw one until week one, but in uh, week 13, that was uh, changed. And then he threw one in week 14. Didn't throw one last week, and then week 15, he, did, he does it here. Or he didn't do one in week 15, and then week 16, he does it again. Oh, Caden Smith slips, and he doesn't even come up with the reception. Third and inches. And Barkley's going to get the first down to Moore. Off to the races is Saquon Barkley. Up to the 43. A tremendous play there from Saquon Barkley. 42 Off yards. to the races, Barkley went. Big play gets him across midfield now for first and ten. Operating from the gun. Jones. And that is going to be Shepard. Oh, gets leveled by catch. Earl Thomas. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. It puts you enough big yardage. Another nice gain there. This one goes for 20. Slants all around. Here's Jones throwing on first. Oh down. gosh. Okay, I I thought I threw another interception there. Um But we didn't. Another strong gain on the last two plays. They moved it a Barkley early in this one is almost at a hundred rushing yards. Is he gonna get that one in? No. Nice pickup of nine yards on first down. X Factor activated, Tro's activated for Saquon Barkley, and as soon as he activates, he goes negative three. And it is third down. And this is going to be intercepted. It's the former Seahawks. Oh my gosh. We did it again. Daniel Jones, this oh my gosh, he is he is playing terrible. I did not expect him to play this bad as Blake Martinez comes down with the tackle. If this keeps going on, I think we're gonna have to bring Jalen Hurts in, guys. And that is gonna end quarter number one. Zero to zero after one. We'll see what uh, what uh, happens at the end of this. Is Blake Martinez is gonna get himself another tackle? Keeps this up and he'll get Player of the Week most likely. Hasn't gotten a Player of the Week yet. It's been Barkley and Jones a lot. I think Leonard Williams and Dexter Lawrence. Oh, you have to grab that, Ryan. Logan Ryan. Almost made up for the turnover we had. Well, the defense certainly did its part to get them the football. But you can't get in the backfield of the punter the there. Way. We're going to have to call fair catch. They're way too close. Doesn't it feel like one after grabbing the momentum with the As defense? Dolphins yeah, lead the Raiders 3 0. The They've now, practically been eliminated from playoff contention. Uh, I don't think they'll be making it. So our first two drives end up in interceptions, um, making Daniel Jones have five interceptions on the year and 56 passing touchdowns. Oh my gosh. What a catch from Sterling Shepard. I thought I threw another interception. Um, we're getting risky with the passes, but uh, this might be the drive. Barkley, he'll get a yard and more. It's a pick About a four-yard game. Barkley, the ball carrier. Brandon, we just saw the benefits of being able to run the ball successfully. They pick up four yards. Here we go. This is the makeup drive. The juke from Barkley. Can he power across the line? No. Now you're behind trying to figure out, do I need to blitz it? Do I need to pressure it? How do I gain an advantage on this step? That is going to be Sterling Shepard, who is off to the races. Down to the six-yard line. Early in this game, Daniel Jones is over 100 passing yards. 
First and goal from the six. It's a rough start, and uh, we've been in the right zone, both interceptions in this one. And that is going to be Barkley to get the first touchdown of the game. His 22nd rushing touchdown of the season. His 25th touchdown. Oh, the ball is going insane. Oh, shoot. He just killed everybody. As his guys are first out of the scoreboard. All right, Graham Gano <laughs> missed two PATs uh, against uh, what was a perfect PAT season. Uh, he missed two against the Cardinals, I think it was. So we then signed Maher, who we were going to play last game, and we forgot to. Um, so Graham Gano on for his first kick of the game. And this one is underway. We changed his number to number 92 just because I like the college numbers on kickers. It's pretty impressive. And more. He's going to sit on this one, and the drive will begin at the 25 yard line. Jackson and the Ravens Here we go. come up now, first and 10 at their own 25 yard line. Lamar Jackson with the He's snap. He throws this one over the middle. Over the middle it is Julian Love, the reigning NFC Defensive Player of the Week. Line. Just a three yard gain there. He had two three interceptions and four there, tackles in that one. Here's second and seven now from the 28. From the gun, Jackson. And that is going to be Logan Ryan. They're going to be short of the first down marker. Third down and one for the Ravens. Striving for a playoff spot. This is a crucial win, and if they are not to win this game, they have to win the last game of the season if they want any chance at making it into the playoffs. We have clinched the uh, the round one bye. Two minute warning. Seven to nothing the score. Ten plays total, five rushes, five passes for the Ravens. And they find Hollywood Brown there. It's going to be about second and two. And we have a wide open Mark Andrews. There's actually a lot of Sooners in this game. Jalen Hurts, Mark Andrews, Marquise Brown, Sterling Shepard. And he finds Mark Andrews again. He's going to be taken down at the 12. 30 yard reception for Mark Andrews, the former tight end for the OU Sooners. From down at the 12, it's first and 10. Throws this one up! It's picked off by Logan Ryan! He'll take it out of the end zone and he'll keep going! Lamar Jackson's gonna have the tackle. Down to the 23 yard line, Logan Ryan is fifth interception of the year. 40 seconds left, we don't have the ball exiting. The second, in the second half, the Ravens will start with the ball. That is pass interference if I've ever seen it. Oh, the camera's blurry. Gonna accept that. That also stops the clock. I just stepped on the cord to my controller. And trying to avoid pass on interference accident. is so difficult. You're trying to slow down these skilled receivers, and somehow, some way, they make plays on the football, and sometimes you're Oh, and that is another pass interference for the Ravens. Two plays in a row. Let's check in with our referee. Five seconds wasted on both of those plays. That is gonna give us the ball on the 21. And no one trying to cover is going to like a call going against them, but you have to like the effort there. Went for the interception, just unable to both get Both of them were over to the sideline as Daniel Jones slips out of the snap. We're gonna scramble. Try to get a juke. Did we get across the line? We're gonna call timeout. Trying to go up two on the Ravens. And that is going to get us over 2,500 rush yards in the year. All right, hopefully Jones does not slip this time. Nobody open, and we're going to take the sack and lose yardage. Oh, okay. Yeah, thanks. Nobody open, so results in a sack. 
Fox was trying to scramble. Third down. We're going to fight Sterling Shepard, who breaks the tackle and is going to get himself into the end zone. Touchdown, Giants. In the final seconds of the first half. Daniel Jones in his 57th passing touchdown of the season. CD for them. This has just been an offensive explosion here in the second quarter. Yeah, held scoreless in the first quarter. Now they find the end zone again here. In and the it is up and good Sometimes for Graham Gano. A lot of people think it's always an adjustment. You have to change what you're doing. Sometimes you just have to do your game plan just a little bit better. And I think that's Daniel Jones. That was the only time he actually the ball actually left his hands in the drive. Uh, that well, that actually counted as a pass without passing. Interference call. So two pass interferences really cost uh, the Ravens in that drive. See what they do. They're going to run the ball and they get lit up and they will call timeout. They do get the ball at half, so they're going to try to at least maybe score this drive and then come out after half and try to get a win. We'll do a halftime show. Play of the half here. Oh, almost another pick, and there's going to be one second left. Brandon Goggins' prediction on one play left in the half is wrong. It's Cincinnati, they're out of the playoffs. Houston, they're out of the playoffs. And this one is just thrown up. Desperation shot, and it is incomplete. So after the first half, it is 14 to nothing. We, the Giants, continue to see if they can get themselves the undefeated season 14 and 0 so far, trying to go 15 and 0. The coach. Here we go. Actually, no, me. Okay, Brandon. Thanks very much. The weather might be cold, but the playoff races are heating up. All right, here's our halftime report. So, where are we going in the USA? We are heading down to Baltimore, Maryland, or, or Washington, whatever. Um, we have Washington leading that game, trying to get their second one of the season. Both of these teams are out of the playoffs, and Washington hold the last, or not like they have Carolina's pick. Actually, I'm pretty sure. All right, in this one, the Niners and the Cardinals. Cardinals are out of the playoffs, and the Niners, they lead that division. They are trying to make the playoffs, which they most likely will have. All right, and now we look at go to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, where the Steelers are leading. I think their playoff hopes might be over. Uh, they are leading, and the Colts, they have the first round by in the AFC. All right, here we go. So we are kicking to start the half. 14 to nothing lead coming into the second half. Let's see what goes down. Of course, the the, the Colts, they are looking really good this season. Uh, probably favored to go to the Super Bowl in the AFC. Washington still looking to get their second one of the season. We actually have their pick. We have the first pick in the freaking draft. I will be doing an off-season episode uh, whenever we get to the off-season. I'm not taking Trevor Lawrence. At least I don't think I am. Uh, I still have no idea who I want to pick with my pick in the first round. Um, but yeah, that first pick. And then we have two second round picks, I think. Oh, we, that would have been a rough in the passer if we made contact there. Um, all right, third down and 10 for Jackson and his Ravens. And that is picked off again! This time it is Grant Haley, his third of the year. The first half did not go their way, and that's not going to help matters at all. And Barkley looking for his 40th career rushing touchdown. We only did three seasons like in Madden 20. I wanted to do five or more. We got to like five seasons and never finished the fifth season in Madden 19. Um, so we're looking to at least get five or more seasons. Hey, I'll take I'll take at least four seasons maybe um anything this is actually the second game in a row where it's a rain game caught by Shepard and he drops it 10 passes for Daniel Jones um in this one rushing has been a big key since Barkley has been back Oh, there's a flag. Is it going to be roughing the passer? 
Big call coming on third down. Yes, it is going to be roughing the passer, so the pass will not count. We're going to accept that. So the Ravens have a terrible drive, first drive in the second half. We might even get a score because of that. Penalty as Barkley cannot get out of the way. He'll get one right up the middle for a first down. Going to audible here. Jones. From the gun, he'll throw. Gonna get out of the pocket, and Jones is not fast enough to get past the line of scrimmage as he has met. Second and goal in the 10 yard line. I tried juking there, we're only gonna go one yard. And it is third down. To make the short field pay off, we'll see if they can. But this is third. Will Graham Gano come out to attempt field a uh, field goal? I did not mean to switch to Barkley. To we had to get rid of that fast. We were about to get sacked. Barkley, he'll get this one to the six-yard line, and it will look like a field goal attempt for Graham Gano, who missed a field goal actually in Super Bowl 50 that cost his team the game. Graham Gano still perfect on field goals, not extra points but field goals on the air. I think Graham Gano has attempted over 90 field goals or extra points, and I, I think he's, he might be like one away maybe from, uh, I, don't, I don't know. He might be, he might have made over 90 extra points this year. It is still possible, depending on how this game goes, for him to hit 100 extra points this year. We'll see though. 17 nothing your score with three minutes and three sec or three minutes and six seconds left not three seconds i'm done um cleveland tied with new york of course cleveland needing to win their games as they run an option with lamar jackson who gets destroyed by brooks here i'll be right back this will probably be edited because i go to the home screen uh when i do this all right, boys, I'm back. We can get this restarted. So 17 to nothing the score. Two minutes, 35 seconds. Lev Jackson gets rid of it. Mark Ingram sheds a tackle. I think he got the first. Yes, he did. Joe Judge not too happy about that. Thought we were going to get the sack there. Kansas City, I think they might have the playoffs uh, locked. And he finds who's that? And he'll get it down on the plate of the third. That is Devern, Devern, something like that. Facing a second and two after that last catch, good for eight yards. And Ingram, he's gonna get a good gain up to the 28-yard line. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. Washington now go down 21 to 17. They're looking for their second win of the year. The best they can finish is three and 13. I doubt that is gonna happen. If they lose this game, the best they will finish is two and, uh, two and 14. It finishes one and 15, so yay. Um, we need that though, because we have Washington's pick and they have like a mid-draft pick. They have Carolina's pick, which we traded our pick to Carolina. So Carolina is probably gonna end up getting the last pick um, in the first round. And then Washington's gonna get like a mid-round pick. And then we're going to get the first pick. Because I, I think at this point it's impossible for us not to get the first pick with Washington's pick. And it is fourth down and 11. So on fourth down, here's the Ravens Pro Bowl kicker, Justin Here we go. Out onto the field. This one from 46 yards out. Almost blocked. Will split the it's 17 to three, we will not shut the Ravens out. And that is gonna end off the third quarter, final quarter of play coming up. So here we go, Corey Ballantyne onto the return, on for the return. Oh, gets met by a read. The Giants take over first and ten. 
I think we might have this win locked up. I don't know. Now. Actually, no, I can't say that. It's only a two position game. Trying to go 15 and 0, and then we play Dallas to wrap the season up. You're just thinking first downs to keep up with your theme there, playing keep away. First downs, they can't touch the ball. Again, it's Barkley. Barkley's able to find the gap. I tried juking, but uh, he just got drilled. I was a little too late on the juke. Third run for 20 plus yards in this one. It's always talked about when you have great vision, you're not consciously thinking about your cuts and your moves, you're just doing it. Earl Thomas is almost there to get another tackle. You took the words right out of my mouth. I was just going to use that phrase. He has run them into submission. Wave the white flag. They'll come up on a second and four now from the 40 yard line. Now left side, a completion to his tight Good juke end. right there. And he's gonna be taken Daniel Jones, 8 for 13, 150 passing yards in this yard one. Line. 22 yards there, a first down. So from the 17 now, here's a Heavy first coverage in the secondary. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. Oh, what a catch that would have been. Zone, but that's gonna wind up incomplete. Golden Tate, his intended receiver. And it's second down. Incomplete. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first. Danny down. Dimes with the snap. Finds Golden Tate and did he get across the line? And he's able to work it here to the eight yard line. Nine yards. Not no, he did enough, not. He'll be left now with third and one. The Giants on third down. They've converted four times out of six. Not bad. They're up against a third and one situation. And we threw it a little early to Darius Slayton, but he is going to catch that for the touchdown. That'll be his first of the game. And the Giants are able to add on to their lead. He got a figure down by the goal line. Oh, it's a fake. They'll try and throw for Joking around. Can we get that flag? And Andrew Thomas. Oh, all right. That was an Andrew Thomas. Let's see what we've got. Roughing the passer. Roughing the passer. Let's just attempt the PAT. All right, that was just a little funny joke. We're kicking this PAT from the one. All right, that's up and good. Just decided to joke around there, and we, we were lucky enough to get the penalty. I'm surprised they didn't say he caught that. New England's practically in the playoffs at this point. I don't think it's possible for them to not be. New Orleans, they're definitely in. Pretty competitive in the NFC for uh, the, between the, the first and second overall teams. If we're being honest, I think the NFC championship will, or the, yeah, NFC championship will end up being, or no, wait. I mean, the NFC divisional will probably be Giants, Saints, and Madden. Because we have the first round bye. Um, so that I think that's what the NFC divisional is going to end up being. Um, I don't know what the NFC... I mean, it'll probably be... Uh, my prediction... If there's going to be, I, I can't predict our game, but I think the third team will make it, to, the third ranked team in the playoffs will make it the NFC Championship. So they are able to get the first down. They're trying to get a touchdown in this one. They have a field goal, no touchdown. We get through the line. We're able to take Mark Ingram down. Lamar Jackson was hit. Of course, I think maybe in week 17, we might see who is most likely going to be in the playoffs. Um, last I checked, there's about 19 teams in contention to still make it. Or, well, there's like, no, 14, I mean, like 14-ish teams. And we almost get another sack. And that is going to be Bethea bringing him down. Less than two minutes to go here in this one. Jackson's gonna scramble, we almost had a pick. And Mark Andrews is gonna take it in for the touchdown. Mark Andrews, his fifth touchdown now on the year. So here we go. Ravens on to attempt the field goal. 
It is up and good. 10 to 24 Ravens. It's a two possession game. Um, I think we are gonna take Daniel Jones out. Uh, keep him rested for week 17, and we are gonna bring in the man, the myth, the legend, Trace McSorley, guys. Um, I'm gonna see if we can get him a passing touchdown. I knew they were gonna onside kick. Um, 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 oh, that was the wrong button. Whoops. Well, we do recover. Julian Love with the recovery. We have it on their 45 yard line. Los Angeles, they're still in the playoffs. They're fighting. It looks like they'll win that one. Here we go. Trace McSorley. I think, yeah, this should be his first pass of the season. Almost threw an interception. That, that was bad. A turnover would have really helped there. Almost intercepted. Instead, it's just second down. Being chased out left. Bad pass and almost an interception two plays in a row for Trace McSorley. Um, not good, no bueno. All right, we're gonna go with the halfback screen and hopefully Trace McSorley will complete this. First, first completion of the season and there it is. And Barkley, he's got a good run for a first down. It's gonna be a 23 yard um, completion for Trace McSorley. That third down conversion, good for 23. Not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and ten. McSorley once more looks to And it is gonna be his first game. Are you are you are you being serious, game? What was that? The stoppage with 65 seconds remaining. I, I have no idea what that was. That was gonna be McSorley's first passing touchdown. Looks like he'll throw here. And McSorley gets stopped behind the line. The Ravens gonna use the second of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with just the Ravens use the timeout. Back at the five yard line now, second and goal. And that is a touchdown. Sterling Shepard. Tristan McSorley gets his first of the season. And his first is a giant. And the Giants are able to grow their lead. Well, there's just about a minute. And all he takes off with we fake it here. Can we get it, though? I don't think we'll get it. We tried. We tried. We tried. We tried. So the attempt at the fake extra point unsuccessful. I have to admit, I'm scratching my Jalen Hurts right there. To make sense of what I just saw. Number one, huge lead. Stress off the field. Just take the extra point and be done with it. Number two. If you he actually had like two, one play in that just line up and game. go for it from the two yard line. Why make it so difficult? That's a long way to go to try and pick up some points. And more, he's gonna sit Lamar Jackson gets back on the field. Yard line. One passing touchdown in this one. Um, Ravens, they're still struggling to keep their hopes alive for playoffs. Intention. Taken down there by Aqib Talib. Aqib Talib. Adjustments are often a big part of each and every game, and it's not just getting to halftime. It's serious. Picked off! And that is a keep to leave who just got attacked. And then has a pick six, too. I think he leads our team in interceptions. Now remember, this is the number one defense. His 12th in the interception of the line. year. Shows that they set an aggressive tone, not just stopping the run, not just getting after the quarterback, but the ball's in the air. They treat it like they're the receivers, and they went after that one and took it all the way. And all he takes off with it, it's Jalen Hurts with the run. Did he get it? No, he did not. They'll say he's out of bounds, shy of the goal line. And they'll be denied on the two-point conversion. Partner, that type of a lead. Gonna sky gonna kick it, it, try to get to the ball quicker. To try and pick up a two-point play instead of kicking it through the post. You know, gets this one away. Sky high kick, pretty short. Yeah, preserve that for it. That's, a, that's an ancient relic, faking it. You, you, I can understand you. You want to rub it in a little, you fake it. Thirty-five seconds remain, and. <laughs> Washington loses by one and they are one and 14 they are one game away from only having a one win season 
Incomplete. Ball on the 30 as they come up second and 10. Wow. <laughs> at the 30 yard line. Throwing again. Jackson. Jackson throws this one away. And it is third down and ten. Jackson 14. For six or um, no, Alright, the, the snap from Lamar Jackson and it's picked off again. Akeem Talib gets his thirteenth interception of the year. Will that be his final? Um, let's just bring Daniel Jones back in for the final 21 seconds of the game. Um, just getting redunculous. Week after week, we're seeing plays like this from him. And I think he's in line. We've discussed it before for NFL Defensive Player of the Year. And a big reason why, I think, is because of his ball skills. And that's yeah, I think Akeem Kalee will get defensive... Player of the year. For years. Done the drills, but it really um, it in 13 interceptions is definitely so one way you can get that award. And oh my gosh! Uh, this is just getting ugly. 40th career rushing touchdown for Saquon Barkley. This is a team that puts on the hard hats, grabs the lunch pail, and tells everyone, we're going to give you a full 60 minutes. And that's exactly how they're playing this one. And out. Graham Gano so sinks another extra ago, point. Four seconds lead. left in the game. I think this calls for a squib. Um, just two plays to get into the end zone. We are going to head Graham into our Gano final game of the off. season with a 15 and 0 record. Following the touchdown here to kick it away. All right, this should just drain most Very of the clock. Short kick. This will be taken by one of the and that is game. Yeah, There's a flag though. The this could result. Yeah, they might be backing up a bit here to start the drive. There's a holding on the returning team. Not gonna matter too so much as that is the end of the game. This could mean a lot for Baltimore. Um, they are definitely going to need to win this uh, next game that they play. If they want any hopes at the playoffs, their record drops to, I think, set. Oh, I don't know what they're. Seven, eight, and. One? I can't remember. This is big for Baltimore. They might be done. Um, I'll show you guys the bracket next episode when we take on the Cowboys to end off our season and uh, get into the postseason. We are heading to the um, divisional or the, the divisional with the first round by um, guarantee. So yeah, well, that is going to end this one. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and we will get into our final game of the season next episode. See you guys in the next one. Bye guys.